Get ready for a financial breakthrough because XRP is on a skyrocketing journey, potentially reaching heights of $1,650 to $2,900 by the end of 2024. This isn't just sensational talk. It's grounded in a significant development. The imminent launch of an XRP ETF. Picture this. BlackRock, the same financial titan that introduced a successful Bitcoin ETF, is turning its expertise to XRP. With an astounding track record, where virtually every ETF proposal they've submitted has been greenlit, BlackRock's move into XRP is a game changer. But wait, there's more. It's not just BlackRock making waves. Grayscale is also stepping into the arena. They've not only proposed an XRP ETF, but have also integrated XRP into their cryptocurrency portfolio. This highlights XRP's and Ripple Labs growing influence in the realm of international transactions. Hello, Moneyside family! Welcome back to your go-to hub for all things XRP. Before we jump into the heart of today's content, let's quickly touch base. I need a small favor from you. Go ahead and smash that like button, hit subscribe, and ring that notification bell to join our amazing community. And here's a little heads up. We're revving up for an incredible XRP giveaway as we approach the 60,000 subscriber mark. Getting involved in the giveaway is a breeze. Just follow three simple steps, so make sure you're tuned in and ready. Also, don't forget to leave a hashtag money side in the comments to secure your spot in the giveaway. Now, let's get into the exciting world of XRP and see what's new today. Upon diving deeper into the data, it becomes clear that BlackRock's reputation in ETF approvals is nearly flawless. As the global leader in asset management, BlackRock's venture into cryptocurrencies and Web 3.0 signifies a pivotal shift in the traditional finance sector's view of digital currencies. Their nearly perfect approval record for ETFs stands as a testament to their unmatched expertise in navigating the financial market. Remember, BlackRock's ETF approval rate is an impressive 99.8%, making them an unstoppable force in the ETF landscape. Understanding the big picture is key here. Major financial players like BlackRock and JP Morgan haven't just been eyeing XRP, they've been actively accumulating it. Reports, including a leaked document, suggest that these giants have invested over 7.5% of their total wealth into XRP. A recent thoroughly vetted article even hinted at BlackRock shifting its focus entirely from Bitcoin to XRP, signaling a significant shift in their investment strategy. This move indicates a surging interest in XRP, making the possibility of a BlackRock-backed XRP ETF more plausible than ever. But here's where it gets even more intriguing. A new development in the XRP saga has emerged the existence of an XRP ETP. The creator of this ETP remains a mystery, but its existence is a critical step towards an ETF. Reports suggest that while the XRP ETP has been launched, it's still in the pre-release phase, valued at zero, but poised for unveiling any day now. And there's more. Rumors are circulating about a simultaneous launch of an XRP ETF, aligning the debut of both the ETP and ETF. This parallel release not only makes sense, but also underscores rapid progress toward the ETF, potentially following just weeks after the launch of a Bitcoin ETF. When we put this into perspective, especially considering Bitcoin's surge to $43,000 even before its ETF launch, the potential for XRP is astronomical. We're talking about a possible explosion in XRP's value, soaring to $1,650 or even $2,500 once its ETF hits the market. Okay, hear me out, because this isn't as far-fetched as it might sound. The XRP ETP has already launched, paving the way directly to an XRP ETF in just a few weeks. Unbeknownst to many, the exchange-traded product for XRP has been officially released by Vidility, a titan in the financial world. World. What this translates to is a rapid move towards the launch of an XRP ETF, anticipated to gain approval from the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission shortly. In fact, just yesterday we discussed a recently published article. It revealed, based on a leaked report from none other than BlackRock, that an XRP ETF might be just around the corner. This leak indicated an imminent ETF filing for XRP. Adding to this excitement, a top BlackRock analyst made a public statement, confirming the launch of a BlackRock ETF specifically for XRP. They even went as far as to reference the iShares XRP Trust in relation to an ATF filing. Initially skeptical, I verified this myself, and lo and behold, it's listed right there on the Delaware list of corporations' website. This development is a game changer, and it shows just how close we are to seeing a seismic shift in XRP's market presence, potentially mirroring or even surpassing the movements we've seen with Bitcoin's ETF. 
Recent research has shed light on a significant development in the crypto world. Both BlackRock and JP Morgan have acquired over 7.5 million XRP, a clear indication of institutional engagement in cryptocurrency. BlackRock is leading the charge, not just by stockpiling XRP, but also by leveraging the XRP ledger in their operations, and most notably, pushing forward with the public release of an XRP ETF. Given BlackRock's near flawless track record with ETF approvals, the likelihood of the XRP ETF getting the green light is extremely high. The impact of an XRP ETF on its value cannot be overstated. This is why a target price of $9,831 for XRP, while seemingly ambitious, starts to make sense when you consider all the pivotal developments lined up. Think about it. XRP is poised to become a key player in handling global debt transactions, especially when you factor in the staggering amounts. We're talking about $1.8 to $1.3 quadrillion, potentially flowing through the XRP ledger, driven primarily by the ISDA. Add to this the involvement of the BRICS nations, including Saudi Arabia, all of whom are integrating the XRP ledger into their systems, and the Republic of Palau, developing its central bank digital currency on the XRP ledger. This scenario presents a classic case of high volume, high demand, and limited supply, which logically points to a skyrocketing value per XRP coin. So, a topic that's been buzzing around lately is this. Some folks think my optimism about XRP is just a daydream. Well, maybe they have a point. But here's what I say. I'm all about embracing this hopium. I'm rolling it up into a giant one, lighting it up, and taking a deep breath. That's some powerful stuff. I'm a firm believer in hope. It's a lifeline, especially when times are tough and you're hanging on. On. If you're not on board with hope and think it's all just wishful thinking, that's totally fine. But I don't see that as a downside. Let's lift each other up. That's my mantra. Anything less just feels like dropping tokens into a void. And that's not what we're about. We're here to stay positive. And speaking of positivity, I'm loving the engaging conversations and challenging views from all of you. It really gets the brain gears turning. One interesting point raised was about institutions and XRP. They don't necessarily have to buy XRP. Leasing is also an option. Now that's a thought worth pondering, isn't it? So, a curious thought crossed my mind. What would happen if only retail investors were buying XRP? I delved into this and even asked ChatGPT about the daily transaction volume of the SWIFT system. The staggering answer was over $7 trillion. And remember, this is just international trade, not including the derivatives market, which is in the quadrillion nor smart contracts, NFTs, or tokenized assets like real estate. Now, imagine XRP's potential involvement in all these areas, but let's narrow it down to just international trade, the area where SWIFT operates. If we take that $7 trillion and cut it to less than half, let's speculate what could happen if XRP, with its 1,700 connections, and yes, Ripple and XRP have really set a high bar here, were to handle just $3 trillion of it daily. That would mean the system needs to sustain $3 trillion dollars within it for that day. This scenario could potentially push the value of XRP to over $1.50 per token. So it's clear, the value is bound to rise. Given XRP's extensive network, it's reasonable to assume that some of these connections will invest in it. And referring back to our previous discussion, even if institutions choose to lease rather than buy, once the system is activated, we could see values soaring past $1.50, especially if XRP handles even half of this market. If it encompasses the entire spectrum of bank transfers, we're talking well over $100 per token. So take a moment, relax with this thought, maybe with an adult beverage in hand. Let the potential of this hopium vision sink in. It's a fascinating world we're in, full of incredible possibilities. Please remember, I am not a licensed financial advisor. The content presented in these videos is purely for entertainment purposes. I always encourage viewers to conduct their own research and consult with professionals before making any financial decisions. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Also, make sure you turn on the notifications to be the first to know when I release new content. I'm excited to catch up with you in the upcoming video. Take care.